Today, we will talk about attribution analysis, definition and how it's used for portfolios. Attribution analysis, also known as return attribution or performance attribution, is a method for evaluating the performance of a portfolio or fund manager. Its goal is to quantitatively analyze a fund manager's investment selections and decisions, and to identify sources of excess returns in comparison to an index or benchmark. Attribution analysis focuses on three factors, investment picks and asset allocation, investment style, and market timing. It begins by identifying the asset class and allocation of different assets within the portfolio. The type of assets helps identify a benchmark for comparing performance, often in the form of a market index or comparable assets. The next step in attribution analysis is to determine the manager's investment style. This provides a benchmark against which to gauge the manager's performance. One method is to analyze the nature of the manager's holdings, such as stocks of large cap or small cap companies, or whether the focus is on value or growth. After identifying a blend of indices that correlate most closely to a manager's returns, the analyst can formulate a customized benchmark to evaluate the manager's performance. This analysis attempts to explain the excess returns, or alpha, that the manager enjoys over those benchmarks. Subsequently, the analyst must determine the portion of alpha attributable to sector and timing in order to isolate stock selection alpha. Market timing, the third factor in attribution analysis, evaluates a manager's decisions to add or subtract positions from the portfolio. Though debated, its measurement is important to gauge a manager's returns against benchmarks reflective of market upturns and downturns. However, many analysts rate market timing as less significant than asset selection and investment style. Here are three key takeaways. 1. Attribution analysis evaluates a portfolio's performance, focusing on investment choices, investment style, and market timing. 2. Asset class and weighting of assets figure in the analysis of investment choices. 3. Investment style reflects the nature of the holdings, and market timing is considered less significant than asset selection and investment style. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.